Hi, I'm Yusuf. In this video, we will talk about the last operation, contour text of mill contour operations. It is a, a engraving operation. First, you must create a text with insert notes. You write the text you want here and locate to a suitable place it will locate uh, to the x-axis if you change the axis it will uh, the uh, text will turn also I find the place and uh, leave it with left mouse button if you want to change the settings, you open the settings and settings button. It must be block font because it must be only one line. It can't be like this, for example. It can't be this. It must be like this. You change the height or font gap vector from here. After this works, you open counter text and use, use a tool for engraving. Uh, these engraving tools are like this. They have very, uh, very small nose. It is one millimeter here. It can be smaller. And you choose the text from this specified drafting text. Okay. It is the depth text step and click generate. You choose no here. Okay. The toolpad is created, but you must look it with view and static wireframe because sometimes the there, there is a gauge occurs and the, uh, the some things, sometimes they are very big gauges. Okay, let's change the depth. Dot three. Okay, for example, there is a gauge here. How will we fix it? We click OK. Uh, right button toolpad edit we choose two of them and delete we are looking to the other letters they are fine or oh, no um, it is because of the form okay we can't do this too much okay um, I click OK if I want to make multiple passes I change it from here multi depth cuts passes tray I click generate again overwrite no and look with static wireframe there is that problem again toolpad edit okay I don't know how to fix them because it's a form and it must make this form. I click OK. For to see the uh, to see the real uh, real view, I uh, first I must define the workpiece and blank with 
offset from part and zero zero offset then I open the operation verify and 3d dynamic as you can see uh, it's a good writing now for now if you can't see the 3d dynamic in your nx11 you can show it by file utilities customer defaults simulation and verification 3d material removal or show 2d dynamic page okay It is all for counter text. Thanks for watching. If you liked the video, please press the like button. Or if you didn't like the video, please press the dislike button and tell the reason on comments. Thank you so much.